So, today we're here on the Bangladesh boat cruise. Boat cruise, yes, a picnic they call it. A boat picnic. Yes, boat picnic. for nine hours. <laughs> it's lunch and breakfast. After my expat diary made some local friends, he got invited on a river cruise sponsored by Bangladeshi cultural program. I was really lucky to have such a nice couch surfing house. Jihad is his name. And he invited me to this boat cruise, which is a whole day on the river with food, drinks, live music, a tombola, and many other activities. This is Ruhama. Yes. And uh, how old are you? I'm five. Five years old already. Wow. The English is really good for your age. <laughs> yeah. Photos, I think, yeah. Photos and selfies. Yeah? Selfies. <laughs> yes. Wow. I like videos. I think nice. it's better. You know, I will keep them as my memories. You know. A video. Yes, I like videos. The river cruise started at the central ferry terminal of Dhaka and headed three hours south on the Dhaleshwari river before it turned around. Now I'm here in the saloon, which is comfortable, but the thing is, even the higher class in Bangladeshi, they're all trashy, you know. People don't know, how, I mean, there are a lot of trash cans on this boat, and still those ministers and like people here. You know, which are not low class, they still trash this place. Yeah, I'm really sad. So, lunch is being served. People lining up. Hold on, yeah. So, you're cutting in line again. <laughs> My seafood. Yeah, I know, I know. It's hey, I'm going to eat. Can I get an almond rice? Yes, hey. Chicken, no beef, rice. chicken, beef. No, lunch is served. <laughs> yes, I'll even wash my hands. So, this is my first time eating with hands here in the Bangladesh. Lots of people eat with hands, right? So, I find it's very, very difficult, you know? You have to grab the rice. Like, people complain it's difficult eating with chopsticks, but I think eating with hands is more difficult. It works. I can eat with hands, but I think it's inconvenient, you know? Let's see if it works. Yeah, because here the fan doesn't work, you know. He's trying to... Yeah, yeah. engineer. Engineer. Yeah. Mr. Stephen, all audience uh, wants to uh, you speak something uh, about our cultural program uh, uh, with English and your mother language. Please carry on. Hello everyone. Thank you very much. I'm very happy to be here. Uh, it's a pleasure and I think it's a very 
good opportunity to talk about culture. Since this is a cultural forum, there are so many cultural differences between Germany and Bangladesh. First of all, I'm very impressed about the Bangladesh uh, hospitality. People are very friendly, um, very welcoming, and I really appreciate the kindness of people. Um, in Germany, people are also very kind, um, but not necessarily to strangers. So it really depends. Um, there are also so many other differences. The, the music, the food, the, uh, the way people behave. Yes. Uh, yes. And, uh, that's, yes, that's why I'm very happy to be here at the uh, Greater Masters. My Mensing. My Mensing Cultural Forum. Yeah, at the uh, Greater Mensing Cultural Forum. Uh, also, it's a big difference about uh, having children in Bangladesh and in Germany. In Germany, people don't have so many children, but in Bangladesh, families are so, so big. Yeah? This is um, a lot about uh, you know, cultural differences. Uh, yeah. Very interesting. So that's why in Germany, people are much more wealthy, but although they have not so many children. That's a um, yeah, interesting question. And in Bangladesh, people might not afford to have so many children, but families are so, so big. Maybe um, it's because abortion is not common or uh, uh, many other reasons. And I would be very, very happy if all of you could come to Germany and visit. Mr. 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 Jarman. Mr. Jarman. Mr. Stephen. Mr. Stephen. Hi. You came here to enjoy with us. And thank you very much, everybody. It was nice that they asked me to hold a little speech here, but I was totally unprepared and I just said what came to my mind. And now it's the top one, huh? Yeah, we got luck, we got a... Which city is that? Monsi Gronch. Oh, okay. This is city. Yes, nice sunset. Marita, yes. Marita. Marita. And uh, what do you think about the youth in uh, Bangladesh? Yeah, like people use YouTube, Facebook and Instagram. Uh, what, Facebook. what is the most popular app? Facebook. Facebook is very popular. Yeah? popular. I see. And what do young people do for fun? Our cultural program is very nice and I like so how many languages do you speak? Do you speak Bangla? Do you speak Hindi? No. No Hindi. No Hindi. Only Bangla and little English. But you learn English in school, right? No. No English in school? So how did you learn English? Yeah. Um, English in school, but I'm Interesting. Okay, thank you very much for the interview and enjoy the sunset. Who's better, India or Bangladesh? In cricket. Bangladesh. Really? Bangladesh won the cup? Yeah, one, yeah Bangladesh will be, yeah, won a cup. Yeah, and what about Pakistan and Sri Lanka? Pakistan is also good uh, in, in cricket. Now Australia is very, very strong team in world cricket. Okay, but Bangladesh is the best. Yeah, Bangladesh is the best. Is, is he telling the truth? Is it true? Bangladesh won? <laughs> really? No, no, I heard India is very strong. Yeah, India, but yeah, Bangladesh is uh, next year. Next year, maybe they win. Yeah. So I also I read on Wikipedia. On Wikipedia, I read that people in Bangladesh get married very, very early. Dharma I like so much. Hmm? Dharma. Yes. Messi, of course, I love Messi. Messi is a very good player. Yeah. Hmm? 
Cristiano Ronaldo, yeah, of course, he's also very good. Yeah. So, uh, do you have any friends who are married? Like, uh, you are 16, right? So, any friends who are 16 already get married in Bangladesh? Because I heard on the, I read on the internet that 60% already get married before the age of 18. No. It's not true. Yeah. So, in your class, nobody's married. Maybe it's before the old generation, the old people. Yeah. So it's. Yeah. It changed a lot. Maybe Wikipedia is uh, not correct. Uh, so I was very curious. German, German. Nice to meet you. Did you play the lottery? <laughs> yeah? I did. No, well, I'm waiting for the TV. The TV uh, is reserved for me. Oh, <laughs> yeah, just, just kidding. I don't know. Maybe, maybe if I'm lucky. <laughs> It was really interesting to me to hear from the young people what they think about their own country and the culture. So many factories. So, Jihad. Yeah? Tell me, how did you like the picnic? Okay. How did you like the picnic? Very, very, very good, yeah. Good, good. I'm You're fine. good, bye. Yes, I enjoyed the cruise very much. You remember me? Here's somebody here is somebody <laughs> looking very shy. Yeah. <laughs> you remembering me when you go back at your home? Yeah, of course. Sure. Yeah. Are these factories or what is it? Yes. And what kind of factory? Some lunch box as the boy present. Yeah. We just got interviewed by Masha Rul Islam. Yeah. And uh, we also got a flower. It's very nice from a little girl. But I give it to Jihad. Thank you for your hospitality. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. And you can give it to a beautiful girl. Yeah. yeah. Because Jihad is looking for a wife. Yeah. <laughs> so hopefully soon you yeah. can find. And today actually you had the appointment, you missed your appointment at the wedding agency. Yeah, that's really a pity. Um, I like to learn more about the culture. I read something interesting which I think is not true. You know Wikipedia, Wikipedia say Wikipedia say 65% of the girls are married before the 18th birthday. This is not true. What? This is not true, right? This is a little bit earlier information. Nowadays everything has been changed. Now people are more educated. Yes. Their guardians are more educated. They don't want to give their you know marriage to their daughter so early. Okay. Now people have been more conscious. The government is more conscious about their that early marriage. It's a it's a earlier information. Now it's old, it's, yeah, it's, it's out outdated. Yeah, outdated. Yeah. So I was shocked. I was shocked about this. Yeah. <laughs> because so, it's it's more, uh, no, Wikipedia. Not, Wikipedia, yeah, yes. Wikipedia. Yeah, Wikipedia. Yeah, so you can update Wikipedia. People are outside. Thank you very much. It was an honor to be here today. Yeah. So we got this into the flowers. Thank you. So that's it from the cruise. It was a truly unforgettable experience and I really enjoyed it. No real tuk tuk. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to My Expert Diary and support this channel.